Hey, how's it going? It's Mordechai here today in the fitness studio. I'm going to give you a very quick review of the new Ultra Superior 4.5 trail running shoe. Uh, this is my sixth shoe that I've tried from Ultra. I've tried two versions of the Escalante, the Torin 4, the Lone Peak, and the um, 1v3. So basically the main trail running shoes of uh, Ultras are the uh, Lone Peaks and the uh, Superiors. This is the Superior 4.5, newest edition of the Superior. Um, overall, extremely happy with this shoe. I want to say, first of all, I took it out of the box and I was like, wow, I love the way the shoe looks. Just the way I like it, not bright or anything like that. All one color, black, but like sleek and classy and like looks great. Um, it's a trail running shoe, so you've got some nice lugs here, grips the trails nicely, all kinds of terrain. Um, and let's see, so it's very, it has, it's uh, typical of ultras, it has the, um, uh, zero drop, meaning same stack height going across the shoe. This one has a more minimal uh, sole, some are, get a little thicker, but this is a minimal stack height um, shoe, so you get some ground feel. It's a little bit like, a, almost like a barefoot shoe in a way. A little more protection than a barefoot shoe, but uh, you still do feel the ground. Uh, for that reason, Ultra includes with the shoe a uh, stone guard, which you can put in there to get a little more protection on your feet. I usually don't use it, to be honest, but um, if I'm going on a little bit more aggressive trail, I sometimes do slip them in, and they're, uh, it's pretty cool. It's a little cool little feature. You also have a gator attachment with this Velcro here. You can uh, attach a Ultra Gator cover for, to stop more of the debris from the trail coming in. So that's a nice feature that most Ultra trail running shoes do include. Um, Ultra is also known for the wide toe box. Now, what's nice about this is it's, it's wide, but it's not super wide where it kind of looks goofy. It looks very sleek and natural, yet your toes have room and they can splay out nicely and you don't get blisters from your feet rubbing together. Uh, while I have this view here, this upper Maybe a little hard to see, but this upper is very small little holes of mesh um, that I really like. It's a really unique upper design because it's it's very it's kind of thick. It's it's more uh, firm mesh, and so it it is good for supporting your foot, but it also has good ventilation. When I was running a marathon in these uh, trail marathon, I went into a river, and uh, water actually drained out nicely. So I was pleased with how water actually left the shoe. Um, but it's, it's, it's a good ventilator. This is new technology. I haven't seen that on the other Ultra shoes. Um, it's a Quantic midsole, which is my favorite kind of Ultra midsoles. It's more firm. Some Ultras have um, what's known as the Ego Foam midsole, which is more squishy, and, and I tend to not like that as much. But this is a nice, firm shoe, which I like, and it can get even firmer if you add this stone guard. Um, and basically, it's super light, just featherweight. You know, like most Ultras does a good job with the, the weight of their shoes. Um, the laces are nice, it nices up, laces up nice and you know fine, no problems with that. Um, and let's see here. I basically, yeah, I've had no, no blisters in them at all. Um, and I ran a trail marathon with them a few weeks ago and they handled great. So this is really one of my favorite shoes by Ultra, which is one of my favorite companies because it's just a comfortable shoe, it's lightweight, and it grips the trails very nicely. And so far the durability looks pretty good, you know, got some mud on it here, but it's not really, uh, it's still got good traction, and it doesn't seem like it's wearing out super quickly. So uh, the new Superior 4.5s from Ultra, so far I've been very pleased with them after about uh, three months of wearing them, including a, a trail uh, marathon. So uh, check it out. Thanks for checking out my review. Take care.